Welcome to, the, to my YouTube channel. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Causes of brain injury in maritime setting. Brain injuries can occur in maritime job in a variety of ways. Accurate brain injuries, for instance, may occur when a worker falls overboard and oxygen is cut off to the brain. The person may be rescued and rescued, but depending on how long the brain was deprived of oxygen. The damage may be non-existence, male or severance. Also common in maritime job are strike to the head. A moving ship can cause object to fall or worker to fall and hit their head. Gear cargo or equipment part may all fall or shift on a ship and hit a worker in the head. In a port, there are similar risks. Rock weather on a ship can increase the risk of item, shifting and striking workers. A deck or other surface that is not slip proof or that is cluttered with gear can also pose trip hazard that can lead to falls and hurt strike. And then next, brain damage and maritime rights. If you suffer a brain injury while on the job on a ship, offshore or in a port, there are laws in place to ensure that you will be compensated. The longshore and harbor workers, compensation acts, and the outer continental self land acts both provide worker compensation for injuries like this sustained while on the job. The Jonas X allows for seamen to seek compensation from employers and their insurance companies if liability for the accident can be shown. There are many ways in which an employer may be found to be negligent when a seaman is the victim of an accident that caused a brain injury. For instance, if workers were not Train it properly in how to secure cargo and its shield and strike someone in the head. That liability lies with the employer who had a, a responsibility for training and safety. Other areas of liability may include faulty equipment, machinery that has not been maintained, lack of safety gears or even too long work shift that lead to fatigues and mistakes that cause accident. If you suffer a brain injury on the job, get medical help as soon as possible and file an accident report with as much detail and witness observation as possible. Then contact a maritime lawyer to help you figure out if you have a case against your employer or if you are eligible for worker compensation under one of the maritime laws. And then next types of brain injury. All brain injuries in adults are categorized as traumatic or acquired. A traumatic brain injury is any damage to the brain or disruption in the function of the brain that is caused by any external force or object striking the head. Traumatic brain injuries can further be broken down into several subtypes. Contusions A contusion is essentially a brace when a strike to the head pros the brain and cause bleedings. Sugary may be required. 
concussions, a concussion result from the shaking of the brain inside the skull and can be caused by direct strike, weapless, or shaking. This is the most common type of traumatic brain injury and it may be male or more severe, causing loss uh, of consciousness, a desert feeling confusions or other symptoms. Diffuse axonal. This is caused by seeking or a strong rotation of the neck and head. Violent accident can cause this and it result in the tearing of nervous and brain tissue. Cop contract soap. This is a pair of contusions, one at the site of impacts on the head and one on the opposite side of the brain, caused by brain streaking the other side of the skull. Penetration. A penetration injury occur when some object, such as a bullet or knife, penetrates the skull and brain. This can cause brain injuries ringing from milk to sever or teeth. Accurate brain injuries can be classified as two types, anoxic and hypoxic. An anoxic injury result from complete lacks of oxygen to the brain. Hypoxic injuries result from the oxygen supply being reduced but not completely cut off the brain. The extent of damage caused by these injuries depend on the duration of oxygen loss or reduction. And then next, what is brain injury? A brain injury is anything that causes brain damage. There are several types of brain injury that a person may suffer with but all are categorized as either traumatic or acute. Sometimes traumatic injuries may be considered acute because this term also refers to any brain injury that occurs after birth and not as a result of genetics or birth trauma. However, in adults generally, Traumatic refers to injuries caused by an external force, such as something striking the head well re refers to injury caused by lacks of oxygen getting to the brains. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to give like, comment, and subscribe.